Hi guys and welcome once again to our new channel where we will be uploading a ton of videos on various extreme durability tests in the coming months. So if you like that type of content then get subscribed so you don't miss a thing. Now I thought I would do this little test as a follow on from my last video of the glass on the gas cooker. So if you haven't already seen that then please take a look at that here in the top right hand corner as you look at the screen and there's also a link to that video in the description below so check that out if you haven't already seen it now even though I did that last video I wasn't entirely sure that this was or wasn't going to crack but you know I thought it would be a very interesting little test to find out anyway like that first video guys a minute quickly passed followed by another minute and then to be honest you know I did kind of think this is probably going to just continue to get hotter and hotter. This was really interesting for me though as this was the first time that I've ever done this with a blowtorch in a glass. It's not something that you do all the time is it? I mean let's be honest. And as you can see it's just starting to glow a soft orange colour. You know it's just very interesting because you kind of you know if you never knew better you really would sort of expect it just to crack or even explode wouldn't you? You know I mean a, a blowtorch on a glass I mean seriously it's just totally nuts really. Now you can see a dent starting to form guys as the glass is becoming hotter and hotter and more malleable like softer you know. So the pressure from the flame is actually starting to push the glass as it's getting softer it's starting to push it inwards. And that's what's creating that dent. Now guys, it didn't actually crack as we now know glass melts at around 4, I say we now know, we did, if you watched the previous video, it melts at around 1400 to 1600 degrees Fahrenheit. As I mentioned that in the previous video. But you can only get it, I say only, get it to about 600 degrees with a blowtorch like this. It takes a little while, so I'll stop the process after about six minutes. But take a look at that dent guys, you can see it's just about starting to become softer. How interesting is that? I mean, I don't know how long it would take with a blowtorch like this. I mean, proper glass blowers, you know, they have a much stronger, bigger flame, don't they? Obviously. What did happen though, just after I stopped recording, the glass started to cool down, like it would, obviously. Plus there's a cool breeze here. It's only February still in the UK. And as it cooled down, it just shattered. Pretty much the same as the previous video where I run it under cold water because that extreme change in temperature where it was hot, the cold water against the hot made it shock and that's what cracked it. Anyway guys, look, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this short second video of our new channel. And if you did, please give it a like and share it with your friends. And please consider subscribing to help us to grow. Thanks for watching. Take care. See you soon.